In Ukraine, the war is taking place not only on the front lines, but also in the economic sphere, where businesses are fighting to survive. After Russia invaded Ukraine, the non-profit group Spend with Ukraine was created to promote Ukrainian goods and services around the world. We focus on companies that create goods and services for individual consumers. So you won't find any agricultural companies on our website or metal equipment producers. But you will find companies that make electronic devices or vehicles. Andy Hunder, president of the American Chamber of Commerce in Ukraine, says local businesses have demonstrated they can survive even during a war. Ukrainians have demonstrated resilience, and the world has noticed. The banking system operates, the internet operates in war-stricken Kyiv better than in some peaceful European cities. Mobile connections work, elevator companies work. At the moment, over 190 Ukrainian companies are represented on the non-profit's website. There are tech companies like Clean My Mac. In the education category, there are apps by Ukrainian developers that help with learning foreign languages. Preply is one of the most popular. We are talking about hundreds of thousands of students that use our platform to learn a foreign language. Another globally known company is ReSpeecher. Its focus is synthesized sound. We've created technology that allows a person to speak with a different person's voice, a totally different voice. In the Mandalorian, we did Luke Skywalker's voice. Company representatives say Spend with Ukraine is bringing them new clients. A Ukrainian national clothing brand, Etnadim, has noticed a similar effect. With the start of the war after Spend with Ukraine was created, we were among the first brands to be represented there. Our web traffic has risen dramatically. We got new customers. Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky wore one of the Vishavankas made by Etnadim. Since then, demand has grown so much, the company can't make them fast enough. Hunter says U.S. companies should prepare to invest in Ukrainian businesses. We say, look what Ukrainians are doing, what resilience they're demonstrating during the war. Just imagine what doing business with Ukrainians would be like when the war is over. Spend with Ukraine hopes to join with more international partners to promote Ukrainian goods around the world. For Lesya Bakalets in Washington, NRI's VOA News.